later on we will have the operation parameters written in table in this window okay this one is strategy so we will define the development strategy we open this tree first global rules okay so we have several rules that will govern this simulation okay this modeling all right you can understand as i talk about this okay the first rule input well trajectories okay so yes that's the first rule input well trajectories for all wells okay and then input input vfp tables okay but we don't have the vfp right now for this example and input well structure all right input well structure and we have the well structure file which is this one well structure what is this well structure this well structure table is taken from this well structure okay so we have the table the name is well structure and that will be used here as one component of our rule okay all right, let's check, not yet. Okay, now, in addition to these global rules, I want to add some other rules, like production and, yeah, production history. So I can do that by clicking this one, add new strategy, or yeah, add new strategy. If you want to create another development strategy that you want to exercise but not all right and okay all right okay but before doing that before ending before adding another rule we we want to show or we want to create the time steps for the calculation okay this time steps that is very important and here we have you can see we have the time for example we have first january 2014 and then we have this one okay and yeah, maybe we can check again the, the format, one table. Okay, the format is like this one, okay? DD, MM, YY. Okay, so we have six dates. First, second, third, fourth, five, fifth and sixth so we should have six time steps okay that's why in strategies we will this one we will use this one open time steps editor or we can also use all right this icon open time steps editor okay and we need to select the development strategy but we only have development strategy one one development strategy so select this one and we can add time steps like using this one add time steps if we want to add single step okay this add time steps is used if you want to add the step one by one that's why the step length is single step one year six months like that okay click cancel i will not use that but what we will do is this one, add time steps from tables because we, we already have the table. That's why we will use that table to make the time steps. If you have RFT log, you can also put that here. Okay, I will use that, use this one. Well production table. I have well history to govern the time steps. So I will use well history to list the time step so you can see we have six time steps 
And now we have these two flags, the first flag for the beginning and the last and the second flag is for the end of the time step. And also maybe we have another time that we want to uh, locate in our time steps. Let's check well structure tables, well structure. Okay, in well structure, we also only have six dates. That's why we only have six steps. Okay, maybe different production history, you have several times, but for perforation, another time. Yeah, the, the list will grow as per the available data. But we only have six dates or six time steps. That's why we only have these dates. Close. F1 and six, but where are the two, three, four, five? We can show them by right click, open time steps editor. Oh, sorry, this one. Uncheck the height steps without rules. Okay, so now I have the this one, the first flag for the start, the beginning of all the history. And this one, the end or the end of the if available history. All right, so now we will add rule here. Right click, add new rule. All right, 